Mind blown. <laughs> what did you say? All I can think of is the Ford acronym. What is it? <laughs> oh, you know. You'll think of it. You'll know when you think of it. Visitor center. That's where we're at, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah we're at the visitor Neo. center. Yeah. Where's the Neil's visitor center? Like always, we got Mike on the camera. Hi. We got Sean and the customer behind us. We're heading down Elephant Hill to go in and weld some steering back together on some Dodge Dakota with Ford axles in it or something like that. We're gonna go check it out. We're gonna go have some fun and. Get this vehicle out of the predicament it's in. So this is that super sharp corner on Elephant Hill where normally you'd back up over there or pull forward then back up. Right, but due to the power of front dig, we are able to just turn. job so bringing this rig is the quickest way to get in here weld it up get out There's scrape marks on the wall for sure. Oh yeah. So many real tough things have died here. Right. Oh yeah. Touching here. Probably touching there. <laughs> yeah, you can see all these scratches down yeah. here. Discovered a vehicle. I think this is who we came to fix. It looks like it's been welded previously, but it attaches to that guy there. It's good news, we can weld it. And even better news, Rory's gonna weld it because it looks like it's in a really difficult place. <laughs> Fantastic. So just driving along and all of a sudden the steering got real squirrely and plowed up the road right here and then I kind of managed to back it up and get it back in here but okay it was uh, one wheel going one way one wheel going the other way man this is a pretty sweet truck what is this this is a 1988 Dodge Dakota highly modified it's got a five liter Ford motor it's got Bronco axles front and rear dude the Mustang motor yeah it's neat I think the biggest thing is is uh pull that cotter pin and that bolt and see if we can get the tie rod in to drop off the pitman arm and then we can get it down here where we can actually get some good weld on it and build some stuff and all right make things happen and we got some tools we haven't That's haven't fun. used them yet whoa oh. bro oh. so shiny right Check. there we go <laughs> i feel better now mike's under there doing his magic that's the guy right there. Hmm. All right. <laughs> me. Mike's me. up. Yeah, yeah. Mike's out. Got difficult. Quit. <laughs> Mike's getting flashbacks. That's what it was. Right? Right. 
because I don't want to hit my hand. Hey Mike, can you pop the hood? Ta ta. Dude, look at that. What? It's Mustang motor. Don't, Five don't. liters of fury. Hey Mike, can you turn the wheel? Yeah, it's all the way. Yeah, go the other way. Hold up. All right, keep going. Yeah. All right, now back. All right. There we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's about where it was. Yeah, all right. Oh yeah, some banana slider, that'll get you places. We brought some angle iron, some round stock. We brought things and stuff. I think if we just pull that cotter pin and bolt off, or nut, and that cotter pin and nut off, and then that steering shock, we can just pull the whole thing off. Bingo. What's his name? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. We don't have any clamps, do we? No. Okay. We're going to make a couple. All right. Can you grab that chunk of Angle iron you brought? Uh, yes. What is this? This is a bun trail welder. This is a spool gun on the trail. So this is a flux core MIG welder. It's mm -hmm. powered off of the Premier power welder. Is that yeah. correct? You can you can run it off multiple batteries. I I prefer going with the MIG welder with the, or with the Premier power welder because then your batteries aren't slowly dying. You just have constant voltage and it just works. Assembly is the reverse of disassembly. Where's the Mountain Dew on it? Where's the Mountain Dew Forged in Mountain oh, Dew. Oh man, there's a big old pile there. Yeah, watch. Yeah, watch, watch yourself. 
Now I feel like there's ants crawling all over me. <laughs> Just because I've seen it. Hold there. Nut. So this is like a bronchota. <laughs> Mike's being a real Mike right now, Sean. Mike? I didn't even say anything. Mike? <laughs> All right. This thing might even uh, drive itself back home. All right. Truck is running. Things are happening. Steering is steering. But we're going to go nice and slow and make sure he makes it the same way we're going. are staying on and everything is holding together back there. There they are. Yeah, this is the goofy corner where they have you back up and do all kind of silly things. But watch this. Put the rear in neutral. Front tires dig over because your back tire is caught on this here little ledge. There it is. Now we're there. Look at these guys. There we go. Sun's up. Look at that, no problem. It's, it's nice that now we have welders on other rigs so that we don't have to bring the wrecker in to places that it doesn't entirely fit. Maybe just a little, there you go. Oh, you're fine. You're doing great. Black bro. Whoa, bro. Hey, look. There's Sean. Hi. Get back his camper all loaded up. Bye. Bye now. Bye now. So we're loaded up. We're heading out. We're gonna go back to the shop and stare at things. What did uh what did you get into? What do you mean? Let's see. Oh my dirty? He, he went into the oh the, the <laughs> oh, I touched the a Ford. Look at, look at that. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's all over me. <laughs> when were you working on stuff? <laughs> I did it for like three seconds and then I got filthy. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs>
Is it better now? It's better now, yeah. Yeah, I can focus. <laughs> All right. I can just see that. It's like, <laughs> it's just... moly, moly, moly. <laughs> <laughs> mole, mole, mole. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs> what he said. <laughs> huh? Huh? Backwards? <laughs> Upside down? Sideways? All right. Hot or not? Warm. Warm. You want some more water? Uh, more water. No, we Sean, we didn't pour water on it, remember? We put water on it. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't pour water on there. The tire's all soaking wet. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> oh, that was a coolant leak. <laughs> yeah, coolant leak. I know, I know. I saw it. Fodge. Fodge. Says that on the tailgate, too. <laughs> nice. We, got we call that one Sandy McSanderson. <laughs> Sandy McBooger. A semblance of an assembly. Some semblance.